Many brides are looking for ways to save money, so they're turning to deals online. Sounds like a great idea, but those sites may not be following through with their big promises. New on Daybreak, ABC 15's Hatzavella shows us how a local bridal shop has to deal with this growing online trend. Everything for this. Yes, I love it. <laughs> a magical moment for Kat Miernik trying on her wedding dress for the first time. Color. Detail, workmanship, how the dress fits, all things a bride to be carefully examines, unless you buy it online. You cannot talk to the person directly, pick up the phone. You don't know what the product looks like. It's an ongoing battle for Frank Kambiki, who owns Once in a Lifetime Bridal in Tempe. He tells me companies overseas use the same pictures you find in his catalogs, luring women with prices hundreds of dollars cheaper. But it's not the same dress. They try to make it. it identical, but they don't use the same beading, they don't use the same fabric, they don't use the same workmanship. He purposely bought a dress online to show the difference. They sewed the whole bottom of this dress like a bell skirt, but the original is not. It's just a straight hemline. Problem is, women don't realize the differences until they get the dress. And at that point, experts tell me it's hard to get in touch with those sites. What we found, they often are based in, um, in Asia. In Hong Kong, in China. And it's not to say all sites based in Hong Kong or China are scams, but unfortunately, many of them um, are. Kat didn't take any chances. She flew from Nashville to try on the dress she fell in love with. In Tempe, Hatsovella, ABC 15 News.